pass. Two more again. Two more. Right side. Get on that grind, baby. Get out, man. Get to work. Let's go. Stay positive, man. Keep your head up. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Push it, 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 push Keep going, keep going, let's go. Hey, let's go, touch the door, we're done baby, let's go, let's go, we're done baby. Ten miles in the books, baby. Hey guys, how you doing? Just got done with my ten miles, baby. And this is in. We're gonna have the rematch between George Madvidal and Nick uh, Nate Diaz. But that should be a fun one, you know. You know George Madvidal, Nate Diaz. Never boring fight when those two are in the octagon. You know, uh, George Madvidal just came off a loss against of. Uh, 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 it was a, uh, uh, Usman, you know, I mean, it was a close fight, you know, I mean, uh, I really thought, uh, George Madrigal pushed the pace, he had an interesting fight, but Usman just, his wrestling is too good, it's too powerful, he just, he made it boring, and, when was the last time Nate Diaz fought? I think the last time Nate Diaz fought was when he fought George Madrigal, you know, it was, it was in a flying knee, I think that it was, no, I'm sorry, the flying knee was the uh, Ben Astrid, I'm sorry. Um, I don't remember how um, George Mavidal finished Nate Diaz, but I do remember, I think, uh, um, him finishing Nate Diaz. In the rematch, you know, I'm always rooting for Nate Diaz, you know, my boy. You know, when I find UFC, you know, he's always very nice to me. He always talks to me. He invited me to go over to Stockton, train at his place, you know, but things didn't work out. Um, uh, I decided to go with the Alpha Male. You know, there was more guys at the time that were my size. At the time there was a uh, Uriah Faber, T.J. Dillashaw, the Chris Holdworth, Holdworth uh, the Kobe Carbrand, it was uh, Dan Steele, Lance Palmer, Dustin Akbari. You know, our uh, dude, Alpha Male, that's the place to be for small guys. So, you know, in the remake, I'm, I'm not sure what's going to happen. You know, I, I'm always moving from Nate Diaz. You know, um, uh, you know, just George Madrid is just so slick, you know. Um, but I really hope that Nate Diaz can, like, you know, push the cardio, um, push the cardio, maybe get a takedown, you know, and work his jiu jitsu on George Madrid. But, you know, George Madrid from ATT, he's with with uh, Ricardo Borio, Mike Brown. He's doing a lot of guys that are good jiu jitsu, so I don't know, man. I think it's a tough fight, but either way, I'm gonna watch it and I'm gonna support Nate Diaz on my support. Alright, guys. That's it for me. Please leave a comment below. Let me know who you think is going to win between the rematch. I'm uh, in the rematch between George Madrigal and Nate Diaz. If you guys have any questions for me or any topics you want me to cover, please leave it in the comment below. I'll be sure to read it and get back to you guys. Until next time, guys. Fire or die. Hey.